Next project is this hole on a motorized projector lift. I got it on Amazon. I have to make some holes in the ceiling. Measured about right for the center of the screen. The directions aren't really clear on the installation of the uh, unit. Uh, however, if you're mechanically inclined or handy, you can make it something. So I'm building this little uh, bracket here to go inside the joist. It'll end up going up like this. This being the front of the unit uh, out of some two by threes, two sheets of plywood. And the unit will mount here. And it's basically studs are 22 and a half apart. Use some, uh, you know, simple straps from Home Depot. Some uh, angle straps to hold on to the stud to hold up the mount and got that guy tied on. We still have to do, uh, I still have to seal the box. Right now it's still got a little draft up in there. Uh, find some stripping to go on the some flashing almost for the sheetrock. Uh, basically, I took the, the cased the box on the inside. So it's cased in there. Sorry, no light. And there goes the unit. So I probably gotta set that little. These two little screws. They uh, it's like a little limit switch. Uh, pretty much it. It's got full extension now. So once I put the projector in, and I can see on my screen, uh, when the screen comes down, where it's at, you know, adjust everything. But pretty much, that's it. Sorry, I'm wearing a mask, so that's why I sound all fugly. This blown in insulation is crazy. Uh, but I wrapped the box up with some insulation the best I could. So I noticed after the install, uh, it was quite warm in the box. So I just grabbed some R64 insulation, uh, wrapped it around the box, foil tape, and then uh, hopefully that helps retain some of that uh, or reduce the heat inside the box 